Assalamu alaikum dear students hope i find you are wrong what's with me understand can you saying what am i what's wrong can you understand what i'm saying right now now i'm saying it properly let's do it again assalamu alaikum how are you all i hope that you all are fine so today we are doing word sequencing word sequencing is very important to have the word in a proper sequence so that it makes sense sequence or order of anything in this world brings the beauty of that particular thing every if you see everything around us is flowing in a proper order in a proper sequence the the change of day and night the rotation of the earth everything is in a proper order so order is very important in our life and it brings discipline like in the start you cannot understand that what was miss saying because my sentences were all jumbled up and they were not making sense so today what we are learning we are learning how to put the word in the proper order to make it to construct a sentence that have a proper meaning so let's try sequencing our words into the proper order so that we can make a proper sentence with a proper meaning okay so read the words that are in front of us a cat barked at floppy does that make any sense we should arrange them in a proper order to make it a complete sentence and this is a sentence from your book so let's check out which sentence is that let's open our book and see floppy barked at a cat so here it is now let's arrange these word accordingly so the first word will be floppy barked and then floppy bark and then what is the third word at at a floppy barked at a cat now let's try another example cross floppy was biff with read again if you will read your sentence 2 3 times it will start making sense in your mind so cross floppy was biff with let's check what was written in our reader the sentence was biff was cross with floppy so now let's arrange the words in this proper order first word will be biff was third cross biff was cross then comes with biff was cross with floppy here is our complete sentence that is now making some sense that biff was cross with floppy you guys did a great job Now let's practice some sentences which are not in the book but still we can arrange them. Now read the words wall the cat was on. Is it making any sense? No, so try to make them in the proper order so that so that it will make sense. So the first word will be what will be the first word? Think what do you think? The first word will be yes, cat. cat was on cat was on the wall very good you guys did great cat was on the wall now it making sense so this is the last example let's try it that will you be able to do it down wilma jumped So Wilma 
jumped down very good wilma jumped down again this is not a sentence from a reader but you can practice different sentences not necessarily from the reader any sentences the boy run down the girl drinks the milk and arrange them like this in a proper order you can write your sentences on the paper cut those paper into those uh, slips uh, short slips sh- uh, rectangular slips and then arrange them like this at home keep practicing the more you practice the more you will learn the more you will do with your hands the more you will be perfect at it i hope that you enjoyed the video we'll see you in the next video till then keep practicing bye